Good evening YouTube, my name is Amos Bro. For this video we are going to be discussing a news story which dropped today um, about Kuroko's basketball and its third season. Now, we knew that was getting a third season. That's not the news story. What is the news story is actually this. Check this out. We now officially know its release date. Originally, there was a report that was going to be in March of next year. That made sense because it would have been around March Madness, so everybody would get to, you know, get ready for it and get ready to see it. Cool. Because, you know, the March Madness tournament here in um, the States is a big deal, so you'd have that in the anticipation for it. Well, then there was a report that also stated it could have been in October of this year. Obviously October is almost over and it's not here yet. So that's not happening. Well we found out officially that it's going to be in January of 2015. Yes. Now I have no issue with this actually and it's going to be the same time dig this. It's going to be the same month as Tokyo Ghoul's second season. So January's already loaded. Like seriously loaded. And I'm actually really excited as far as seeing these two series together when January comes. Here's the thing. Uh, we do know this about one of the schools. We do know their voice cast. Uh, one of the schools that will be involved in the best four that's the final four, is Rakuzen. And they will have new cast members to play three of the five uncrowned kings. They are Wataru Hatano as Ryo Mabuchi, Toshiki Masuda as Kotaro Hayama, and Takahiro Fujiwara as Ikichi, if I'm pronouncing that right, I apologize if I'm not, Nabuya. They will also be participating in the drama CD uh, later. Now, this is an interesting thing because um, we already knew we were getting season three. How soon we were going to get it kind of was up in the air, right? Okay. Um, season one, by the way, for, for those who don't know, when season one ended, it ended after the Kaijo Toho Academy match in the Inter High. We ended this cup this past season in um, the quarterfinal match or after the quarterfinal match between Yolson, one of the Generation of Miracles schools, and uh, Saturn. Fun fact by the way, uh, Kisho Tani Taniyama the, yes, the man who plays Lin Sukamori uh, in La Corte de Roro. He also plays one of the characters in Yutapri. And he also played uh, Ryoma Sakamoto in Bakamatsu Rock. Yeah, he played um, the, quote, brother of Taiga Kagame. So that was kind of interesting. But anyway. So that season ended, but ended on the cliffhanger. So everybody's thinking, okay, are they going to end this entire series on that cliffhanger, or are we going to at least go to see them face uh, Rakuzen? Well, it looks like we're going to get there. And it should be exciting to see how they managed to do this, because, keep this in mind, the original manga, because there's one, uh, there's a sequel manga coming out in December. The original manga ended at 275 chapters, right? When they faced the cruising. So where do we end here? That is the question. And the bigger question is, how much of it is going to be rushed? You, do, you don't want to see, and this, was, this is my fear, remember. You don't want to see this season get rushed 100, rushed going 100 miles an hour. You just don't. So, 
fingers crossed that, you know, they don't screw this up. Because I made um, no bones about it that uh, Kuroko's basketball is like one of my, it is my favorite anime of all time right now. And do I think a completely rushed third season would kill it? No. It's, it's almost, I'm not saying completely, but it's almost bulletproof. Okay. But my big thing is I do not want to see this completely fucked up. We also don't know the number of episodes. Chances are it's going to be 25 just like the last two have been. Which would uh, make it like, well, it's already at least from the ones that I've seen, the second longest basketball anime. Uh, first is going to be Slam Dunk at 101, although I haven't seen that one yet. So the question comes here. Uh, what are your thoughts on Kuroko's Basketball premiering in January? Like I said, me, I'm kind of excited because I want to see where they go from here. But I'm also nervous because I don't want to see this story get screwed up. I don't want to see them rush it. And they have their best four, their final four coming up. So, are they rushing to the end, or are they going to take their time with it? That is the question. Like I said, fingers crossed, they don't screw this up, my, friend, my friends. But I'll be interested to hear what you've got to say, because uh, this is definitely going to be an interesting time when we get to January, and we have ghouls and basketball. Yes. So... I shall talk to you all uh, later. You'll de I'll definitely be talking to you again on Tuesday when we're reviewing the free anime as a whole. Take care, gang. Bye-bye.